Hi everyone, so I'm not sure if you have seen me yet. I may have put in like a little vlog bit or I might do it in a minute. Um, but if not, hello, my name is Latasha and welcome to my channel. And if you are new, then hey. Um, so, obviously today is a, another charity shop haul, but I did also film me going around the shops with my sister and her partner. So, um, yeah, I can insert that footage for you now and then you kind of get like a vlog and a... Um, haul all in one so I'll put that footage in for you right now. It's been a while since I showed you guys something that I'm working on um, but here is um, an owl definitely inspired by Harry Potter. I've got a little envelope to go in his mouth. Yeah so here you go here he is with the little envelope in his mouth. Um, I haven't added the feathers yet I sort of like did this project and then just sort of stopped. Um, it's not um, it's not an order for anyone I just wanted to make it so here it is, but yeah, it's been a while since I showed you guys something, so there you go. Look how sweet! So freaking cute. I got loads of stuff today. Look, you like vintage stuff, that's cool. There's loads today, everything's new. That's a good way of just getting past things. Best t-shirt, £1. Yeah. Oh look, old curiosity shop, Charles Dickens and Oh yeah, that's cute. It's really cute, isn't it? That's really cool. That is really cute. Pretty damn cool. Remember my mum used to have stuff like that? Yeah, weird. She did, didn't she? It was so weird. Nice vase up there. I like that green one. I know, it's cool, isn't it? I've seen oh it a few God. times. Oh, God. It's like old-fashioned as hell. Wouldn't you think the salt would dry out, though, or something? Yeah. Oh, look how cute. That is cute. Very vintage. I think you're supposed to put those beads in. Oh, they are a look. Oh, my God, that's so cute. Ooh, fine quality tea. That's have, gorgeous. You have to turn off, like, tank yeah, you know that natural tea I've got with the. Oh yeah, it's like that. You can put that in it. Is that all it's for? Well, I don't know, but that's what I put in it. <laughs> that's what you put in it. Yeah. yeah. You got wallpaper. They've got like this wall chart. I've got that fabric at home. <laughs> Check out the fabrics. Okay. Bit too bedding. Bit too bedding. That could make a nice vintage dress though. Yeah, what do you think? A nice top or something. Oh my god, yeah, I did used to have them. Um, that's weird, isn't it? Just £2, you can earn them again. For just two. Do you think that's too bedding or do you think that could make a nice top? Do you think that's too bedding or? No. No. They're cute. Cute little set. Oh, look at these for your little herbs. Cool. Don't like no one's watching. I like these. Four ninety nine for all of them. Yellow. Yeah. Cool shape to them. Just tying a little bow. Okay. It looks so nice though. Just, ow, just on it. Yeah, it looks really nice. Look at it. You found all the good stuff. Look at that. Uh, correction, you find it. I, I mean, I found it. it, but you fit it. Wow. I fit into the stuff. No, you yeah. The change of If these were bigger, I'd buy them. They're tiny though. What do you drink? Just an espresso out of it or oh, something? Oh yeah, or a, like one of them mint teas. Like a mint tea in there. I'm not so cute. They're just tiny, tiny. Yeah. So, look at this though. This is so cute. I don't need any more mugs, but I want you. It's so pretty. Each layer smells differently. They're good. Mm, yeah, that's good. They've got loads of them, haven't they? So many. Got a nice big section of candles and stuff. Oh, baby, They've got plugins too. Free bathroom. Mm -hmm. Smells good, that. All the different ones. 
Love it, love it. Got these for my new little candle holders. Ooh, cute. Anyway, so I'll just get into the, the whole side of it. Obviously, I have dyed my hair. Uh, as you can see, I'm not blonde anymore, but I now have this like bright orange strip. Um, I really like it, but it's, it's taken some getting used to because like I've had bright coloured hair before. And like I've obviously this has always been uh, the copper red colour because um, I use henna, but with all of it being so bright because obviously I've had been used to having the blonde at the front, which is a really like regular hair colour. Um, and then all of a sudden like now it's like bright orange peach. I'm like, Ooh. every time I look in the mirror, I'm like, but I think I do really like it. So let me know what you think in the comments. Um, yeah, I, I think I think I like it. Um, so let's just get into the haul. Excuse the camera chopping off the top of my head, um, but I couldn't put it back anymore. I mean, I could move back a bit, I guess. But now I feel like I'm so far away. I'm just gonna stay here. <laughs> so um, getting into the haul, first off, I bought all these different wools. I'm gonna make some tassels for my work. Um, so yeah, I, I just got all these wools, but they're on something I bought from the chat shop. So I actually got all of these from the, the works. I bought like every single color that they had, except like the browns. Um, so let me just put these off. Um, and I can show you the tray. So we went shopping in Ripon, uh, where I live, and in Harrogate, which is the next town over. Um, and, uh, Harry, it's a lot bigger, um, and it's a really like well-off area. Um, but I just feel like their charity shops suck, like really suck. There's like nothing in there really. I found like one shop which was decent. It was a cancer research, and that was decent. The prices were good, and it had good stuff in it. it had plenty in there. But every single other one that we went into was just like a complete flop. They, it felt like they were empty, and they were just full of things that were like either like covered in bobbles or like really outdated, or the prices were crazy. Um, so yeah, um, I picked up this tray in the Cancer Research for £2, yeah, £2, look at it, and it's not like um, plywood or anything, it's like proper wood, as you can see, it's quite thick, um, it's not like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's it's good wood, it looks kind of like mango wood, I don't know if it'll have it on here anywhere, um, but it's got some nice notches in there, um, uh, it says made in India. I feel like this is something you'd get at TK Maxx. So it's got the original price on the back is $16.99, but it's in dollars. Some places, it says some places sell it for $25 and some places $16.99. It's from Marshalls. That's an American store. Um, we don't have that here, so I don't know how this ended up here. Um, but I like it. So I come through Marshalls. Look at that. Um, I really like it. It's like, it's nice. It's got like the proper planks in there. It's it's quite heavy. Um, for two pounds, I mean, look at the hardware on it. It's beautiful. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I wanted it. So I'm probably gonna put it on a table and then have like a candle, a TV remote, um, a plant, that sort of thing on it. And then if I ever want to use the table, I can just, you know? Um, or I might put my sewing machine on it and every time I wanna use that, I lift it, I don't know. I don't know, but uh, two pounds, okay? You cannot say no for two pounds. So moving on, so moving on. Sorry, the lighting's really funny at the minute. I'm in the kitchen and I feel like the lighting is weird, but like there's a window, uh, I don't know. So um, anyway, I've, I've got this. This wasn't from uh, the charity shop, this is from the pound shop, but I wanted it. <laughs> so onto the charity shop, proper charity shop stuff. So I got the tray and then next off, I got this beautiful scarf. It was one pound 49. So I obviously didn't need another scarf, and I have scarves very, very similar to this one, but it was £1.49, so I felt obligated to get it, um, because it was just, it's so nice, it's my style, and it was so cheap. Um, it's its beautiful, it's a lovely scarf, it's really wide as well. Um, so, yeah, I got a scarf for £1.49, look how beautiful that is. Like the colours, it's like oranges, browns, neutrals, so yeah, really happy with that one. Next up, I've got some clothing. So I'm not gonna like do this like homework clothing that I'm just gonna mix it all up with whatever I pull out of the bag. So I got this green t-shirt. Um, I really need more t-shirts. I don't have very many t-shirts and with summer coming up, 
you know i just wanted to stock up so this is by simply b it's a size 14 uh it's brand new with with the tags and it was four pounds um and yeah so it's a just a basic green top it's got like this cute little lettuce trim on the on the arm there and i just thought yeah, why not i need more t-shirts so here we have the green t-shirt um it's just a basic t-shirt this one's like a scoop neck which isn't the most flattering uh neckline on me personally i like more sharp lines but um it's very comfortable it's got like the little um lettuce trim on the edges there a couple of little buttons which they are functional buttons um and it's got lettuce trim at the bottom too so i like the length of this one i think it sits really nice there um yeah just a nice basic t-shirt not much to say about it um it's really comfy so there you go so next up i feel like a lot of people are gonna like because i love i love so anyway just like some pillow candles um but not those <laughs> but i had been in the shop and i'd been shopping and i bought some stuff and i was leaving the shop and if you follow my thrifted instagram thrifted to splendid latasha john then you will have seen these because i posted them already but um, I w left the shop and I was walking past the window and they have this really gorgeous chair in the window It's like a mustard colored chair. It's brand new. Um, it got it actually got donated to them by D D DFS Shut the, the sofa place. It got dono donated directly to them by them And so the retail price is at 1200 and so the charity shop has the chair for 650 pounds. It's beautiful but so I was looking at that and in the corner of my eye I saw these i saw these on a shelf and i just i needed them look at them look it's a moon and sun it's um i thought it was brass but no they're silver but i think it's brass underneath the silver i think it's probably like covered in silver um they're heavy they're beautiful like can we not look at them <gasps> they're so nice i just love them so much and guess what can you see that is it backwards i don't know three pounds for both for the pair, that's £1.50 each. And they're proper metal. Look how beautiful they are. Like, excuse my nail polish. <laughs> um, I just, I love them. I love them so much. And £3. I honestly, the poor woman had to move so many things out of the way to get these for me. There was like, chest of drawers in the way, beds. There was all sorts in the way, loads of furniture. And she literally saw me like, I went back in the shop and I was like, oh, I really want that, but it's so far away. And she came over and she just started moving stuff out of the way and she gave them to me and she said, um, she says, don't tell me off for the price. I didn't price them, I don't know how much they are. And I was like, okay, so I feel like they're gonna be expensive now. Um, and I looked, three pounds. And I said to her, I was like, they're three pounds. And she's like, she's like, oh, well that's good then. I was like, that's amazing. So I definitely bought them. I think they could have been a lot more than that and I probably still would have bought them because I just think, what a find. Like, what a find, look. So cute, I really like them. Um, so yeah, there we go, love that. And then I bought the four, the four candles to go in, obviously. Um, so next up, I just got another basic t-shirt. This was 2 99 it's from Next and it is a 14. Um, and it's just a black t-shirt, but it has buttons down it. I don't know if they're working or if it's just to show. No, it's definitely just for show. <laughs> um, but it's got like ruching here and also like the sleeves have like this, um, I don't know if you can see that cause it's black, but they're not, it's not just like a regular neckline. And I just thought it was a, a plain black t-shirt, but with something extra, like a little bit of extra interest. And I love a black t-shirt, so. Yeah, I picked that up and it was uh, 2 99 so, you know. So, here is the black top. Um, I think for a t-shirt, this is so flattering. Like, look at the shape that it gives. It shows, like, quite a good amount of the chest, which, you know, sometimes you're in the mood to, sometimes you're not. Um, I love this. This looks really nice. So, the way, this is what I mean by the detail that sort of, like, scoops under the arm. Um, but it gives this diamond shape. Now, I think this is cool. Can you imagine this with like one of those like corset type belts? That'd look really nice. I don't have one of those, but that'd look nice. Um, so yeah, it's got like the little cap sleeves and then it's quite a long t-shirt, but you can obviously pull it up if you want and make it, well, you could tuck it in if you wanted to. So you have like that sort of look, um, which is cute in itself. I feel like it's quite pin-up looking, if that makes sense. It's quite like that sort of style. 
um but i love black with the red hair or the orange hair um i love the way black looks with it so what what a nice t-shirt like i really like that i don't i don't know if i would wear it like this probably it, i think that looks good um but also i would just you know i'd wear it like that too so next up i found some fabric so i am planning on doing some clothing that i am i'm gonna actually start making clothing um, from vintage patterns that I find in the charity shops. Now, when I went shopping the other day, it was a Sunday, and none of the charity shops um, that sell these patterns were actually open, so that's typical. <laughs> um, but yeah, I usually find so many of these patterns, and on the day I went to go get some, all the shops I needed were actually closed. So, but I did find this fabric, so this is obviously a pillowcase, but it comes with the, the double bedding. Um, but it is like this floral and um, it's got little leaves and then flowers and I thought for like a little vintage top with some little like um, off the shoulder sleeves and frills like that would be really nice like that would be really nice so I picked it up anyway and that will be included in that video so for the double duvet and everything it was only four pounds and oh it's super king it's a super king sized and it was four pounds so I'm gonna use this for fabric uh, where do I put it? <laughs> Digana. Okay, so next up, this is from Harrogate as well. Um, I found two towels. They are in this gorgeous sage green. So the towels in the Cancer Research are brand new. They're new with tags. Um, and they are actually like one of the Cancer Research's new products. So these are really nice towels, actually. Like, really nice. I wasn't going to get them. And then I said, oh, you need towels. I was like, I know, but... Um, not, I'm not going to get them in here just because I thought they'd be used and I'd draw a line at towels but um, no they're not the brand new I asked and they are new um, so this one is just a regular uh, bath towel and it was £4.49 so quite a random price there uh, £4.49 for that one and I just got one of those for the kids and then I got myself a bath sheet you know one of the really big ones um, and it was £6.49 and um, so yeah, like, I got two green towels. I would have bought more, but they didn't actually have any more. If they did, I would have bought two of the big ones, and I'd have bought probably like four of the smaller ones. Um, maybe even some hand towels, but they didn't have them, and that's fine. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy. They, they feel really good. Mm. And I needed them. I needed towels. I, it's so annoying when you can't, when you go, like, you want a bath, you want a shower, and you go to get a towel, and like, there's only small ones left. Like, that is so annoying. Like, I'm five foot eight and a size 14 okay those tiny towels they're not fitting me they're not <laughs> they're just not so i need these ones mm, they're really nice so pop those down there so i'm actually on to my last two things but these things are really really nice so i honestly felt like i bought more oh i'm wearing a pet that's why i bought jeans and i'm wearing them <laughs> so i will do a little like cut away and show you the jeans I feel like to get my whole outfit in, you've got to see my fridge <laughs> and you can't see my head. Um, but here are the jeans that I found. So um, I feel like I look a bit like a criminal today. I don't know what it is, but I, I'm giving me like um, 60s gang vibes. And I don't know what film in reference that's to, but I feel like they all wear denim and they've got tattoos. I don't know. That's just what I'm feeling right now. But I like it. <laughs> So here is my little outfit. So I got this one um, a few videos ago, but I didn't try it on. So here it is here. It's like a denim top. Um, I really, really like it. It really pulls me in here. Um, but yeah, I think it looks really, really cute. No? Look so cute. That was my cat jumping right in front of the camera. Um, and here are the jeans. So um, <laughs> funny story. I did not realize that the holes in these were so big. Like, my whole leg is out. <laughs> I thought they were little slits, um, and I like the little slits at the knee, That that's fine. It actually relieves pressure off of the jeans. But this, um, <laughs> when I first put them on, I put my leg through that hole. I put my leg through it. So I don't know if these really are my style or if I'll cut them into shorts or something, I don't know. But they fit me so nice everywhere else. So these are from New Look. Um, in the chat shop obviously but originally new look and they were only £3.50 £3.50 the slits are they're, they're a bit much for me personally like 
that's a lot of leg <laughs> but they fit so nice if i come up here they are like the only pair of jeans i have like ever found that fit me perfectly in the fact of like everywhere fits so they like hug my hips and then come up where my waist goes in the jeans do and they fit my hip and my waist the way that they should and i never have that i usually have like if it fits here it's usually a little bit baggy up here um but yeah i really like them Woo, look at that yeah yeah Woo, doo, 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 doo. i like them doo, 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 doo. I feel like um, it's gone really dark, <laughs> but I feel like um, the, all, the all denim vibe with the red hair is like, it's a statement, it's a lot. Um, but yeah, I kind of like it. <laughs> Let me know what you think. So yeah, these are the jeans. Um, so moving on to these clothing items. Mm, I accidentally cut the tags off yesterday because I didn't, th I wasn't thinking about it. But this one was four pounds and it's a medium um and it is a kind of like a kimono type thing if you see here it's got like slits in it so it's in three little sections but look how beautiful that is that is so pretty and it was four pounds and i thought can you imagine okay imagine jeans little top this red lipstick heeled boots if i was going out for a drink that's so nice um so yeah i just i really wanted it i thought it was so nice i don't know where it's from oh it's from uh lurry things 100 percent polyester um i've never heard of that and i don't even know if i'm saying it right is that focusing can you see that there you go um yeah but i just thought it's absolutely beautiful and it was four pounds so i picked that one up so here is this so i've just looked at this top and it is next not simply be the green one simply be this one's from next um so yeah but here is the sort of what is this like a what do they call these i can't remember what they call them um <laughs> but here it is so it goes all the way down to the floor and i am tall and this is this is right down to my ankles but look how cute this outfit is this is so nice so you do this with like just plain black heels or something um i think you can tie it as well so let's just do that, just to see. If I tie it, I feel like I'm in a dressing gown. So here it is, tied. Look how nice. I don't know if you can see it when I'm far away like that, but it's got like the slits here. Like, bam. I think this is really cute. Really, really cute. And I love the... I love the pattern, the colour, like with the red hair, I keep saying red, it's orange, with the with the orange hair and the red in this, I imagine a red lip, black top, it's so nice, really happy with that, I, I feel like this has been a very, very successful haul. And for my last item, where are we? So this is by TU, which is Sainsbury's. It's a size 16 and it was £4.25 and it is a dress. So um, it's like patchwork style um, and I just thought it's like a full length, really long dress. And I thought it was really nice. It's got the little pops of orange in there. It'll match my hair. Um, I haven't tried it on. I don't know if it's how it's going to fit, if it's going to be nice or not. But I thought, you know, £4.25, you can't say no. So... I know you can't see the whole thing, but it goes all the way down to my feet. Um, and like I said, I'm quite tall and I'm five foot eight. So um, that's actually like unheard of, <laughs> really. Um, yeah, this is it. So it has like the tight little band here that comes in and then it's like this big pattern. So I'm not sure if I'm wearing the pattern or if the pattern is wearing me in this instance, um, you know, cause it's a lot, it's a lot with my hair. Um, I've just left, I've left the jeans on underneath, but you can't see them. So here it is. I think the shape of it's really nice. Um, it, for me personally, I feel like I, it's quite mumsy, but I'm a mum and I do the school run, uh, twice a day. So in summer, I feel like this dress is going to be like so nice to just throw on and you don't even have to think about anything. You literally have one thing to just, to just throw on and that's it. So 
Let me know what you think about this one in the comments. Is it too much? Um, do you like it? I think it's definitely a statement, statement piece, right? That is actually it for today's haul. So I feel like I haven't, like, didn't buy that much, but I did find a few good things. Like I say in my previous videos, I'm trying not to just buy things, like, willy-nilly, unless I really want it. I did leave a few things in the shop that I thought, oh, I could buy that, but I didn't because I thought, I haven't got a use for you and I've got nowhere to put you. So... These things that I bought I am really really happy with, I feel like they're nice, I don't know what the clothes look like yet because I haven't tried them on, so you'll find out when I do, which is in this video, uh, you'll have seen it, so let me know in the comments down below what you think of the clothing items. Um, but yeah, so that is actually going to be it from me in this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you do want some more videos with me, with me and my sister, um, you know, we'll like go film and we'll like walk around the shops and then we'll like sit down and do a haul together and show you everything we bought together, then um, please do let me know. That'd be great. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it from me. Please do think about subscribing to the channel and liking this video. Um, and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Bye.